Hi, this is a short video to show you how to get your free online bank account from a company with called Stripe. Having an account with Stripe is mandatory for Caregiver Match and it allows you to receive electronic payments directly to this account from your clients. So let's get started. First of all, we're going to click on this link here that says Stripe and it'll take you to a new page in your profile. We need to press this button here, connect with Stripe. And when you do, you're going to arrive on a screen that looks very similar to this below. And you'll note here it says that read below the instructions for connecting with Stripe. So in this video, I'm going to walk through these instructions here, which will all be on the similar page when you connect here with Stripe. So as we scroll down to start with these questions, you have to leave this as Canada. Tell us about your business. Well, that's you as a caregiver. So you could write something similar to what we've written in here, but anything that describes your caregiving skills is fine. Account details, your business type. Uh, it says to choose your type of business. Most caregivers will be a sole proprietor, which just means a, a singular person having a business. Uh, unless you've actually incorporated, but most caregivers will be this first option. You can uh, enter your personal address for your business address, so that could be your home address, and your website is uscaregivermatch.com. Under personal details, they're asking for your legal name, so that's your full first name and last name, and your date of birth. It's asking for a SIN here, but it's showing optional, so we would recommend not putting in your SIN number. Credit card statement details. This is going to be the description of what a client will see on their visa statement when their visa gets charged. We highly recommend that you put your first name and caregiver match. So as an example, Susan-caregivermatch is something that would go in here. And then you would write our phone number, which is 1-833-83-MATCH. Therefore, if there are any complaints with the charges, we will receive those calls, not you. The next step is banking details. Currency is Canadian. You have to put your transit number, institution number, and account number all in this area here, and then confirm your account number. One way to look at this on your checks is to go to the bottom of your check and you'll notice that the transit number is in this area here. It's a five digit number. The financial institution number is a three digit number and the remaining digits are typically your account number. So those are the numbers that you would enter into this field. And this is the account where your payments can be transferred to once they are in your Stripe account. So you will have the ability to transfer money into the account of your choosing. So complete your banking information in this area here using those numbers on the bottom of your check. If you have any questions, you should call your bank. They will be able to give you this information. At the bottom, you want to uh, pick uh, an email and a password that will be your access to your Stripe account. So this should be private and confidential, and it should be something that you know and that you use regularly. So once you've done all of those steps and you submit, your bank account should be created and you can start receiving payments from your Caregiver Match clients. Remember, going to this button here and connecting with Stripe is where you're going to find that page with all of the information that you need to fill out. If you have any questions, please call our office.